a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Oklahoma Oklahoma is a state in the south-central region of the United States. It is the 20th most extensive, and the 28th most populous of the 50 United States. The state's name is derived from the Choctaw words Oklahoma and Hummer, meaning, red people. It is also known informally by its nickname, the Sooner State, in reference to the non-native settlers who staked their claims on land before the official opening date and the Indian Appropriations Act of 1889, which dramatically increased European-American settlement in the Indian Territory. Oklahoma Territory and Indian Territory were merged, and Indian was dropped from the name. On November 16, 1907, Oklahoma became the 46th state to enter the Union. Its residents are known as Oklahomans, or informally as Okies, and its capital and largest city is Oklahoma City. A major producer of natural gas, oil, and agricultural products, Oklahoma relies on an economic base of aviation, energy, telecommunications, and biotechnology. Both Oklahoma City and Tulsa serve as Oklahoma's primary economic anchors, with nearly two-thirds of Oklahomans living within their metropolitan statistical areas. With small mountain ranges, prairie, mesas, and eastern forests, most of Oklahoma lies in the Great Plains, Cross Timbers, and the U.S. Interior Highlands, a region prone mainly to severe weather. In addition to having a prevalence of English, German, Scottish, Scots-Irish, African American, and Native American ancestry, more than 25 Native American languages are spoken in Oklahoma, ranking third behind Alaska and California. Oklahoma is on a confluence of three major American cultural regions and historically served as a route for cattle drives, a destination for southern settlers, and a government-sanctioned territory for Native Americans. Etymology the name Oklahoma comes from the Choctaw phrase Oklahoma Hummer, literally meaning red people. Choctaw Nation Chief Allen Wright suggested the name in 1866 during treaty negotiations with the federal government on the use of Indian Territory, in which he envisioned an all-Indian state controlled by the United States Superintendent of Indian Affairs, equivalent to the English word Indian. Oklahoma Hummer was a phrase in the Choctaw language that described Native American people as a whole. Oklahoma later became the de facto name for Oklahoma Territory, and it was officially approved in 1890, two years after the area was opened to white settlers. Geography Oklahoma is the 20th largest state in the United States, covering an area of 69,898 square miles, with 68,667 square miles of land, and 1,281 square miles of water. It lies partly in the Great Plains near the geographical center of the 48 contiguous states. It is bounded on the east by Arkansas and Missouri, on the north by Kansas, on the northwest by Colorado, on the far west by New Mexico, and on the south and near west by Texas. Much of its border with Texas lies along the southern Oklahoma Olacogen, a failed continental rift. The geologic figure defines the placement of the Red River. The Oklahoma Panhandle's western edge is out of alignment with its Texas border. The Oklahoma-New Mexico border is 2.1 to 2.2 miles east of the Texas line. The border between Texas and New Mexico was set first as a result of a survey by Spain in 1819. It was then set along the 103rd meridian. In the 1890s, when Oklahoma was formally surveyed using more accurate surveying equipment and techniques, it was discovered the Texas line was not set along the 103rd meridian. Surveying techniques were not as accurate in 1819, and the actual 103rd meridian was approximately 2.2 miles to the east. It was much easier to leave the mistake than for Texas to seed land to New Mexico to correct the surveying error. The placement of the Oklahoma-New Mexico border represents the true 103rd meridian. Cimarron County in Oklahoma's Panhandle is the only county in the United States that touches four other states, New Mexico, Texas, Colorado, and Kansas. Topography Oklahoma is between the Great Plains and the Ozark Plateau in the Gulf of Mexico watershed, generally sloping from the high plains of its western boundary to the low wetlands of its southeastern boundary. Its highest and lowest points follow this trend. 
with its highest peak, Black Mesa, at 4,973 feet above sea level, situated near its far northwest corner in the Oklahoma Panhandle. The state's lowest point is on the Little River near its far southeastern boundary near the town of Idabel, Oklahoma, which dips to 289 feet above sea level. Among the most geographically diverse states, Oklahoma is one of four to harbor more than 10 distinct ecological regions, with 11 in its borders more per square mile than in any other state. Its western and eastern halves, however, are marked by extreme differences in geographical diversity. Eastern Oklahoma touches eight ecological regions and its western half contains three. Although having fewer ecological regions western Oklahoma contains many rare, relic species. Oklahoma has four primary mountain ranges, the Washita Mountains, the Arbuckle Mountains, the Wichita Mountains, and the Ozark Mountains. Contained within the U.S. Interior Highlands region, the Ozark and Washita Mountains are the only major mountainous region between the Rocky Mountains and the Appalachians. A portion of the Flint Hills stretches into north-central Oklahoma, and near the state's eastern border. The Oklahoma Tourism and Recreation Department regards Cavanaugh Hill as the world's tallest hill, at 1,999 feet. It fails their definition of a mountain by one foot. The semi-arid high plains in the state's northwestern corner harbor few natural forests. The region has a rolling to flat landscape with intermittent canyons and mesa ranges like the Glass Mountains. Partial plains interrupted by small. Sky Island mountain ranges like the Antelope Hills and the Wichita Mountains. Southwestern Oklahoma, Transitional Prairie, and Oak Savannas cover the central portion of the state. The Ozark and Washita Mountains rise from west to east over the state's eastern third, gradually increasing in elevation in an eastward direction. More than 500 named creeks and rivers make up Oklahoma's waterways, and, with 200 lakes created by dams, it holds the nation's highest number of artificial reservoirs. Most of the state lies in two primary drainage basins belonging to the Red and Arkansas rivers, though the Lee and Little rivers also contain significant drainage basins. Flora and Fauna Due to Oklahoma's location at the confluence of many geographic regions, the state's climatic regions have a high rate of biodiversity. Forests cover 24% of Oklahoma and prairie grasslands composed of short grass, mixed grass, and tall grass prairie, harbor expansive ecosystems in the state's central and western portions, although cropland has largely replaced native grasses. Where rainfall is sparse in the state's western regions, short grass prairie and the shrublands are the most prominent ecosystems, though pinion pines, red cedar, and ponderosa pines grow near rivers and creek beds in the panhandle's far western reaches. Southwestern Oklahoma contains many rare, disjunct species including sugar maple, big tooth maple, Nolina and southern live oak, marshlands, cypress forests and mixtures of shortleaf pine, loblolly pine, blue palmetto, and deciduous forests dominate the state's southeastern quarter, while mixtures of largely post oak, elm, red cedar, and pine forests cover northeastern Oklahoma. The state holds populations of white-tailed deer, mule deer, antelope, coyotes, mountain lions, bobcats, elk, and birds such as quail, doves, cardinals, bald eagles, red-tailed hawks, and pheasants. In prairie ecosystems, American bison, greater prairie chickens, badgers, and armadillo are common, and some of the nation's largest prairie dog towns inhabit short grass prairie in the state's panhandle. The Cross Timbers, a region transitioning from prairie to woodlands in central Oklahoma, harbors 351 vertebrate species. The Washita Mountains are home to black bear, red fox, gray fox, and river otter populations, which coexist with 328 vertebrate species in southeastern Oklahoma. Also, in southeastern Oklahoma lives the American alligator. Protected Lands Oklahoma has 50 state parks, 6 national parks or protected regions, 2 national protected forests or grasslands and a network of wildlife preserves and conservation areas. 6% of the state's 10 million acres of forest is public land. 
including the western portions of the Washita National Forest, the largest and oldest national forest in the southern United States, with 39,000 acres. The Tall Grass Prairie Preserve in north central Oklahoma is the largest protected area of tall grass prairie in the world, and is part of an ecosystem that encompasses only 10% of its former land area, once covering 14 states. In addition, the Black Kettle National Grassland covers 31,300 acres of prairie in southwestern Oklahoma. The Wichita Mountains Wildlife Refuge is the oldest and largest of nine national wildlife refuges in the state and was founded in 1901, encompassing 59,020 acres of Oklahoma's federally protected parks or recreational sites. The Chickasaw National Recreation Area is the largest, with 9,898.63 acres. Other sites include the Santa Fe and Trail of Tears National Historic Trails, the Fort Smith and Washita Battlefield National Historic Sites, and the Oklahoma City National Memorial. Climate Oklahoma is in a humid subtropical region. Oklahoma lies in a transition zone between humid continental climate to the north, semi-arid climate, to the west, and humid subtropical climate in the central, south and eastern portions of the state. Most of the state lies in an area known as Tornado Alley characterized by frequent interaction between cold, dry air from Canada, warm to hot, dry air from Mexico and the southwestern US and warm, moist air from the Gulf of Mexico. The interactions between these three contrasting air currents produces severe weather, with a frequency virtually unseen anywhere else on planet Earth. An average 62 tornadoes strike the state per year, one of the highest rates in the world. Because of Oklahoma's position between zones of differing prevailing temperature and winds, weather patterns within the state can vary widely, over relatively short distances and can change drastically in a short time. As an example, on November 11, 1911, the temperature at Oklahoma City reached 83 degrees Fahrenheit in the afternoon, then an Arctic cold front of unprecedented intensity slammed across the state, causing the temperature to fall 66 degrees, down to 17 degrees Fahrenheit at midnight. Thus, both the record high and record low for November 11 were set on the same date. This type of phenomenon is also responsible for many of the tornadoes in the area such as the 1912 Oklahoma tornado outbreak, when a warm front traveled along a stalled cold front, resulting in an average of about one tornado per hour over the course of a day. The humid subtropical climate of central, southern, and eastern Oklahoma is influenced heavily by southerly winds bringing moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. Traveling westward, the climate transitions progressively toward a semi-arid zone in the high plains of the Panhandle and other western areas from about Lawton westward, less frequently touched by southern moisture. Precipitation and temperatures decline from east to west accordingly, with areas in the southeast averaging an annual temperature of 62 degrees Fahrenheit and an annual rainfall of generally over 40 in and up to 56 in, while areas of the Panhandle average 58 degrees Fahrenheit, with an annual rainfall under 17 inches over almost all of Oklahoma. Winter is the driest season. Average monthly precipitation increases dramatically in the spring to a peak in May, the wettest month over most of the state, with its frequent and not uncommonly severe thunderstorm activity. Early June can still be wet, but most years see a marked decrease in rainfall during June and early July. Midsummer represents a secondary dry season over much of Oklahoma with long stretches of hot weather, with only sporadic thunderstorm activity not uncommon many years. Severe drought is common in the hottest summers, such as those of 1934, 1954, 1980, and 2011, all of which featured weeks on end of virtual rainlessness and high temperatures well over 100 F average precipitation rises again. From September to mid-October, representing a secondary wetter season, then declines from late October through December. All of the state frequently experiences temperatures above 100 degrees Fahrenheit or below zero degrees Fahrenheit, though below zero temperatures are rare in south-central and southeastern Oklahoma. Snowfall ranges from an average of less than 4 in in the south to just over 20 in on the border of Colorado and the Panhandle. The state is home to the Storm Prediction Center the National Severe Storms Laboratory, and the Warning Decision Training Division. 
all part of the National Weather Service and in Norman, Oklahoma's highest recorded temperature of 120F was recorded at Tipton on June 27, 1994 and the lowest recorded temperature of 31F was recorded at Nawatu on February 10, 2011. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries. Would you like to know more?